how's it going guys? My name is Coach Young here at Fit Body Bootcamp located in Fountain Valley. Today I'm going to show you guys some exercises that you guys can all do at home with just a set of dumbbells. It's going to be a full body workout but with an emphasis on the shoulders. So moving on to the first exercise, grab a pair of dumbbells, lift them up to your shoulders, your palms should be facing you. You're going to squat down, keep the back straight, come up, and as you come up, you want to rotate those hands and the palms should be facing away from you as you do it. So once again, you go down and then you go up just like so. If you guys cannot do the Arnold presses, you can always just do the shoulder press regularly just like this. So squat down as low as you can go and up just like so. Just like that. You want to complete about 15 reps. And then after that, we're going to go straight into the renegade row. Place the dumbbells on the floor, go in a plank position, you want to row with one arm, row with the other arm, and do a push up. If that gets too challenging for you guys, you can uh, always drop to the knees, do a row that way, do a row that way, and then do a push up. One thing to remember guys, when you do the push up on the knees, remember, your butt should not be high up in the air like this, that is more of a pike up shoulder press. You want to keep the hips low to the ground and push up that way. Once again, we want to complete about 15 reps. Then we're going to move on to our shoulder exercise. Stand up tall. And then you're going to raise the dumbbells forward. And then raise the dumbbells sideways just like so. You can always do this in a split stance as well to activate more of the core. Like this. Like that. So I recommend either doing just 20 reps with a regular uh, neutral position like this, or you guys can go in a split stance, do one, two, and you want to complete eight reps on each leg, and switch and do eight reps on the other. And the modification for this guys is just lower the weights for shoulder exercises you really don't have to go that heavy um, don't ego lift when it comes to shoulders it's very injury prone so take your time and go at your own pace and uh, you you'll see great results I guarantee it and so for the final exercise we're gonna move on to a weighted crunch you're gonna hold the dumbbell place it on your clavicle right below the clavicle or upper chest lay flat on your back and they're gonna crunch up. Remember, this is not a setup where you come all the way up. This is a crunch where the primary focus is on the upper abs. You're gonna crunch up like this. And if you wanna make a challenge for yourself, go ahead, raise your legs. Don't, rest those, uh, don't let those feet rest on the floor. And then you're gonna come up and you're gonna complete about 25 reps. And if that gets challenging for you guys, you can always just drop the weights and just body weight crunches. And if that gets too challenging, go ahead and drop the speed and just finish the crunches this way. Now, and as always, you want to make it a little bit more challenging for yourself, grab a heavier weight, you can always make small adjustments here and there. So thank you for joining me for this workout, guys. My name is Coach Young here at Fit Body Bootcamp at Fountain Valley. Please come join us for a workout session or find the Fit Body Bootcamp near you. Have a great day.